So if you're watching this, then you are part of the family because there's no clickbaity title or any current topic that I'm talking about in this video. This is just a channel update. This is basically me talking about the channel. And if you care about the channel, you're probably watching it. And if you only care about video game news or any stories or any stuff like this, then you're not watching it. So if you're watching it, I just wanted to say thank you. I really mean it because you're supporting the channel. Even you don't comment and just lurking in the background. Even you're using an ad blocker to, to block the ads on the videos. I really don't care. I appreciate that you're on the channel, that you're watching the content, that sometimes maybe you're engaging with the content, even it doesn't reflect your opinion. And I'm just thankful that at this point, we have like a small community of people that enjoy the content and just have fun with it and come back and maybe bring friends and even share the videos and stuff. And all this is, it's really touching, man. It's really, I mean, we're not doing huge numbers. Obviously, you, YouTube is a numbers game and um, I'm not pushing the numbers as well. You know, I'm not jumping on trending topics just for the sake of it because you know how YouTube works. I could just go to the trending page and see what people are looking at and if people are talking about Squid Game. Oh, let's do a video about Squid Game. The problem is I don't give a shit about Squid Game. Okay, that's the thing. So I'm not going to jump on these topics that are trending just because they're trending and because YouTube kind of takes these videos and puts them on the front page and then you get loads of views. I could do that, but I feel I want to do videos and that was always the idea of this channel in a way. I want to do videos that I care about and that genuinely that I genuinely find interesting, so to say. So that's what I do. And in a way that limits my growth, because if you never play the game that YouTube wants you to play, it's also like regular uploads and all that stuff, then obviously it's not really how this works. But be aware that I'm not on YouTube to make money or to be famous or any of those things. This is really not not the ambition. I think the original idea of this channel was to create a platform where I can broadcast ideas and thoughts because in the 90s I did placements at radio stations and it was like, oh, oh, you want to you wanna do a radio show? You want to put content out there that you care about? Well, how about you invest 80,000 pounds in this equipment? And now we're at the point where all you need is the PC that you have anyway and, and a mediocre camera and you can make any content you want and I just like that idea. I think that's a really neat thing that we're living in a day and age where we can do that with absolute minimum effort. So the priority is not to be rich, famous or grow, uh, but the priority is to, to make content that I care about and that you guys care about and that there is kind of a dialogue and that we kind of create, even it's just a small community of maybe a few hundred people uh, that maybe have like-minded ideas and like-minded interests right and when i make a video about something you've never heard about like some weird tribe somewhere in the jungle that people are like hey that's cool i didn't know about it. i didn't know this exists so that's one side of it and then the other side of it is that obviously if you do it as long as i do even i like i said didn't do it for a long time stopped in the middle didn't care i was never consistent in uploading to this channel but if you do it that long eventually you will make a video that gets a lot of views and um, obviously that happened i have a few videos that have a few hundred thousand views and stuff and that is then also a motivator right you're like it's a bit like you're just throwing stuff at a wall and some of them stick you know you're like yeah look here we have videos that are watched by a few hundred people most of them because that's the community these are the people that care about the channel but here we have a video that has 400,000 views and that's nice so in a way it becomes a game if you want it to be or not but it does become a game where you're like you know this giga chat meme i love that meme let's make a video about that and then the video blows up for mysterious reasons and people keep watching it like crazy till this day and it's fun you know i mean that's that's just fun when you have a video that blows up and, and pulls all the views and obviously you're making a little bit of money with it as well. So I think these are the, the points where we are at now. Um, so on one hand, I'm trying to stick to what I really care about, but on the other hand, it's also trying out what sticks and I'm trying to strike that balance. Um, but at the same time, like I said, I'm not here to, to make money, so I, I'm not gonna commit to it full time. And there will always be a week or two where I'm not uploading a video because I have other stuff to do, okay? I've got two kids, you know, I've got a life outside of YouTube and uh, it takes up a lot of my time. So there will always be in a way this kind of irregularity in my uploads. And that just means that, you know, YouTube will not favorize me because I'm not delivering enough content for them. They aren't getting enough money with me. So probably for quite a while, we will remain a small channel. But the truth is we've been growing 
quite quite substantially in the re at least for my numbers for my scale right in the recent month a few videos got a few thousand views and bringing in a few more subscribers a few more people who care about the content and that's great you know that's just like a little bonus in a way right uh, to to me doing this because it's just nice even at small numbers but you upload a video and you get like 50 views more or less immediately because there are 50 people out there i mean that's a bus full of people think about that that's the way i think about it at least um of people who are like yeah well that's cool man i like this and to be honest whatever you talk about i find it interesting and i might disagree with some points i find that interesting so that's cool it makes me happy and i just wanted to use this opportunity to say thank you guys honestly i really mean it uh, even we are a small community and even my the view numbers on, on most of my videos don't line up with the 9,000 subscribers but that's fine uh, because I think a lot of people also just subscribe because, you know, out of courtesy, they, they like the video and they're like, yeah, it's a good video. I'll subscribe to the guy and then they never look at the channel again. And that's fair as well. That's totally OK. Uh, I don't mind that. Um, but I'm just really happy with where it's at right now and that we have some people who keep coming back and that when I upload a video, a few people care about it. And all that just makes it on one hand easier for me to create content, uh, I'm a bit more motivated to do it. On the other hand, it also puts me in a position where I feel a little bit more obliged to deliver content to you guys. And I'm like, oh, I didn't do a video in 10 days now. I really should do something. And that's not a bad thing as well, right? Because it keeps you going. I've been doing this channel for a long, long time now. And I really enjoy going back to the videos that I did 100 years ago. Even they're really cringy often and like just really bad. It's fine. They're all going to stay up because in a way it's, it's a timeline, you know, and... Everyone was cringy probably 10, 15, 20 years ago. And we all change. We all evolve to some extent, hopefully. And um, I like to see that change. And I'm not ashamed of, of what I was or any of the videos that I did a long time ago. Oh, yeah. And I, I just upload tutorial. That's another thing I wanted to mention. If I'm uploading tutorials or a review for an iPhone or whatever it is, you know, don't be like, oh, no, he's turning to a review channel. No, but you got to understand, like, these videos turn over money in the long run like whether it's a review or a tutorial they all get like 10 20 000 clicks over the period of a year or two or three so they do throw back a little bit money to the channel which ultimately supports the channel and i can set up these memberships now but i, I in youtube but i don't feel that enough people are you know really out there that i can ask you guys to become a member or something pay a fee if we get exclusive videos I might do that. Maybe I'll do that at 10,000 subscribers. It's totally possible. But uh, right now, I, I don't feel like that would be appropriate um, for you guys as well. Because I don't want to lock content behind a wall or something. It's really a weird move. It's not what this is all about. It's about openness and sharing. So at least at this point, <laughs> let's let's see how we're going forward. But yeah, I just uploaded this video about fixing uh, Crash and Red Dead Redemption. Don't blame me. There will always be new content that the kind of content that you guys like and enjoy. But every now and then I will sprinkle in videos that you might find a bit odd, but it's really just about getting a few clicks over the few years on these videos. Um, so it re it increases the revenue of the channel because that's also not bad if the channel returns a little bit money. I appreciate your time, guys. Sorry, I've been rambling for too long. And yeah, stay tuned. There's more to come. And even if I'm not uploading a video for a month, there will always be new content on this channel. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. I'm out. Bye.